Good morning and I hope everyone had a great weekend. It is now Monday. We have plenty of sunshine, blue skies, and it's a lot more comfortable today than it was yesterday. We had a heat index value of 114 yesterday afternoon in Greenville, which is uh, pretty incredible, but we're going to have much lower humidity today. It's going to be slightly cooler this week, so that's something to look forward to, and we're going to have low rain chances. So taking a look at the national view, we're going to step back really quick. There we go. There's the cold front that passed through. That is now kind of moving off to the east. Temperatures are much cooler. Notice we're about nearly 10 degrees cooler than Atlanta this morning. There's also a couple of post tropical storms now spinning in the open Atlantic, Josephine and Kyle. But again, those um, really not going to impact. Actually, they're both going to probably be um, pretty much gone by the end of the day. So that's uh, good. But we also have two more systems we're tracking in the Atlantic Basin that could potentially become tropical uh, by the end of the week. So that's something we're going to continue to monitor. Fortunately for us, nothing going to affect us anytime soon. And uh, all right, we're going backwards again. Uh, taking a look at your satellite and radar, not a whole lot going on. Cloud cover, um, uh, just a couple of clouds along I-55. But notice no rain across Delta or the Magnolia state. It's a dry morning, so if you're traveling out, uh, good news for you. You're not going to run into any wet roadways or anything like that, and it, it feels really good this morning. It, it's about in the lower 70s everywhere. We're still holding on to the 60s here in Greenville, but probably in the next 15 minutes, we'll bump above 70, 75 in Jackson, 73 in Clarksdale, and 72 in Monticello, so uh, much cooler than this time yesterday. 10 degrees cooler in Mo Bastrop, and Greenville, eight in Monticello, nine in Clarksdale. So again, especially where that cold front has passed through, um, we are looking at much cooler temperatures. So always good to see this time of the year. And just keep in mind, we got to get through August and September, then we'll start to see that cool down. Uh, so definitely good there. As for your future tracker, 90 degrees today, no rain expected. It's going to be dry. We have high pressure and plenty of dry air overhead as we wake up tomorrow morning. We're looking at 60s again. It's going to be another comfortable start. Uh, temperature is going to be in the 90s more than likely. There could be a couple of pop up showers in the eastern Mississippi, but for most of us, it's going to stay dry. And as we go into the overnight hours again, no rain expected. And then as we wake up on Wednesday, it's going to be quite cool. We're looking at mid 60s and then upper 60s as the sun begins to set our rise actually. Um, so again, it's going to feel nice each and every morning this week. Rain chances are going to be low, so if you like the sunshine, this is a great forecast for you. Only about a 20% chance of a pop-up shower Friday into Saturday. So again, for the most part, no one's going to see any rain. There still could be a stray shower here or there. It is the summer in Mississippi, so it can't be completely ruled out. But again, as we head into the next six to 10 days, it also looks like we're going to have below average rainfall as well. So definitely a drier pattern setting up as we finish off August. As for the Mississippi River, holding steady under 25 feet expected to drop a little more between now and Saturday well below flood stage level same for the Yazoo River pretty much holding steady at around 18 feet so for today again less humid plenty of sunshine highs of 90 degrees a nice breeze out of the north northeast high still going to top out around 90 so that cold front did come through and that really just helped lower that humidity it's still going to be a hot day but nowhere near as stuffy as yesterday Tonight, we're looking at lows of 67, clear and comfortable, and area-wide, we're going to be in the mid to upper 60s as we wake up on your Tuesday morning. And for tomorrow, it's going to be another calm day, plenty of sunshine, highs of 92 degrees. And over the next seven days, again, middle of the week, Low average temperatures going to hold steady in the 90s through this weekend with only a small chance of a shower Friday and Saturday.